New tonight, a major announcement from the Ohio Department of Health. The director released an order that high school athletes in contact sports will be required to get tested for COVID-19 in order to play or scrimmage against opposing schools. Sports Team 27's Josh Verkettik joins us live right now in the newsroom with more details. Josh. And thanks, Keely. You know, this has uh, been coming out the last couple of days from the Ohio Department of Health and just a few days before that the OHSA was saying that they were going to go ahead without the plan of testing for the coronavirus. But this health department order from the state of Ohio coming out yesterday and it's actually an update from a previous order from the director a few months ago, actually on July 4th. Now testing will be required to be in place for contact sports, but there was actually never a definition on what a contact sport actually was according to the health department. Now the order states under section 10 that players, coaches, trainers, support staff and officials will require a negative test no more than 72 hours before travel to be able to participate in a game against another school. If there is a positive test, not just the positive person would not be able to participate, but the entire team. These current guidelines do not just include fall sports either. There are some winter sports and also some travel sports included as well. So the big question is, what is a contact sport according to the Ohio Health Department? We'll have that coming up later on in sports. Plus, you're going to hear from a local athletic director on what he thinks what will happen with fall sports now that testing will be required for contact sports. That's all coming up in just about 10 minutes for now. Live in the newsroom, I'm Josh Riketic, Sports Team 27.